Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Bro here, and welcome back to another Elden Ring DLC build video. Today I'm going to be using a build focused entirely around the throwing pots. There's a huge variety of ways you can build the character to use throwing pots. You can go the strength build route, the dexterity route, magic, faith, really whatever you enjoy. But I feel like lightning is my favorite option when it comes to the pots because it has really good variety. The standard lightning pot, which you can have 20 of, the one that just uses the crack pot, has really good damage for being just a crack pot. There's quite a few options for the ritual pot, but I like to go with the red lightning pot because it has some AoE when it connects with any surface. It's pretty big, so if you're fighting a team of three and they're in a small area, you're getting a lot of damage out of just one pot, just because it does around four, five hundred damage just from that AoE. And then we have the lightning pot, definitely your biggest burst damage on the build, so I'm going to of course be using the hefty lightning pot. This thing does a lot of damage, especially if you stack it with the lightning shrouding crack tier, which does enhance your lightning on all your pots, so you may as well always be running that. My main strategy is to use some of my smaller pots like the standard lightning pot and the red lightning pot to get the opponents accustomed to taking that kind of damage. And then when they rush me we use endure to trade and we throw a hefty lightning pot, usually finishing them off because that can do some severe damage. The amount of people I got with the endure into the hefty pot was pretty funny. They just really don't expect it because they see you're holding a fist type weapon and you're also just throwing pots at them so they don't assume you can do really big burst damage like that. As for the stats, I have my 80 dexterity because I'm trying to maximize the damage on all my lightning pots and they scale the best from dex. I have my large health pool of course and then I have the minimum endurance needed for my armor and the helm that I'm wearing. Speaking of armor, the great jar helm is very important for the build because it does increase your pot's damage by 16% and the companion jar does increase the damage as well, increasing it by 20% and they stack so you do want to use both of these on a build focused entirely around pots. The rest of the talisman choices are really up to you. I want a little bit more HP since I'm going to be using Endure to throw my hefty pots. And then we have the Urtree Favor plus 2 for the equip load mostly, but it does give HP and stamina. And the Bulgo talisman is there because I don't like getting stunned from the second hit of light weapons. I'd rather have the poise to be able to tank that. That really covers all the information that I have to say about the build though. I hope you guys enjoy the invasions. The Brace of the Halig Tree. Hey look, it's our favorite spear. Well, everyone's favorite spear. Hi guys. Random pots. Big pot. No, wait. No, I don't want to kill that one. You're in the way. Okay, good. He lived. Lightning pot. <laughs> what about baby lightning pot? Not close enough meat to grab me. I'm sorry. Nice. I was able to dodge that. Which is weird because it seemed like it phantom hit me. <laughs> but I'm okay with it. Hey there. Hey, do the ash. That's fine. Not gonna do the follow up. Oh. This is for the fall back line there. Oop. <laughs> nice. Our connection's good. <laughs> Which is making it very hard for him. Ooh, <laughs> the unlock on snipe. Oh, I love the, the change to swift slash. <laughs> Against my OP pot build, he had to pull out the swift slash. Amazing. <laughs> Midra's Mance. Oh, I'm by where they need to go to pull the lever. Oh, well, hello there, casters. How are you? I just like to introduce myself. Pot? Oh, no, that ruined my giant pot, dude. What? Oh, I meant to throw the giant pot. Okay, a lot of things just turned wrong there, unfortunately. This is for you guys. Hello. Your body was actually in my way, physically. Ah, it's chasing me. <laughs> That's funny. Let's chase pretty well. All right, so I'm thinking the guy with the Colossal, we're going to just have to endure and trade constantly because I don't think we're hitting him any other way. Hey there. Whoa. Into this. Bonk. That worked. Into this. The backstab attempt. Oh, two for one? No way. As if that had the radius to hit the guy here. Oh, I love these spots so much. The hefty ones are my favorite. Well, it is definitely dark in here. Hello there, guys. Oh, I almost jumped off. Wait. I'm going to put a lantern on. It's dark. I need light. Hi there. How's it going? Ash of War? Can I sprint around it? I can. Into red pot. Hey there. <laughs> I dodged your whole ash of war. Ooh. 
Pretty solid damage on that. He's running for his life. He's gonna run off a cliff. He doesn't know what to do. He's attacking. And then POTS! Oh, he luckily dodged that, honestly. These are pretty good to hit with. Yeah. You know what? The AoE is solid on them. He goes for the heal. Oh, he's just dodging for his life. I'm rolling through that. Backstab, you okay? Pots can't backstab. <laughs> we did use lots of our red lightning pots there, though. I think we're gonna have to do this. Dodge by. I need him to think I'm weak. Into giant lightning pot. Nice. Endure again into giant lightning pot. One more giant lightning pot endure. <laughs> nice. Baby pot for you. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the pot fight. <laughs> Sanguine summoned. Nice. So we at least have one phantom. And I think they're at the beginning here. Yep. Are you boys prepared for the pot throws? Hello. How's it going? Hello. Um, hey, look. It's the, uh, the chase down axis. Let's see how that works. Lightning pot. Whoa. <laughs> sanguine is not a sanguine build. I thought someone would be aggressive there. Nope. Hey there. <gasps> Trying to block me in isn't going to work that well. Sir, I'm going to roll by you because that's getting dangerous. One. Big pot coming your way as well. Two. Hey, there's one down. Whoa. Oh. Why is the one that goes down always the host? <laughs> That's so funny. Anytime I launch an item into the crowd, somehow the host just dies first. A near a limb. Perfect, perfect. Oh, well, if they come near this guy, you know, this could be super evil to do. But I'm going to do it anyway. Hi, guys. How's it going? Hello. Wait, is that a red? No. It is not a red. That is a wizard. Oh, it's raining. This could be good. That's the host, though, I'm pretty sure. Why are you guys chilling so far in the back? That's just wrong. I'm gonna go for the wizard. Uh, okay, fine. I guess I'll just kill this guy, then, since you're leaving him here with me. <laughs> Popped his bubble tear. Wizard, that's for you! Nice. Wizard, this is for you again! Perfect. I'm going to keep the wizard on lock here. Perfect. Oh. It's for you, though. Both of you. Dodge star shower. Perfect. That won't reach me, and unfortunately, this might kill you. Big pot! <gasps> Goodbye, wizard! <laughs> Wait. Oh, that one was the host. What? Oh, I seen your name first. I don't know why, even though you definitely look like a summon, I thought you were the host. Unfortunate, wizard. <laughs> nice. I absolutely love the Mogwin Dynasty. I don't get many invasions here, though. Well, hello, guys. How's it going? Let me just buff up my friends here. Hang on. I'm going to use this anyway. May as well buff them up. Ooh. Hey there, if you're going to be launching spells, this is for you. <laughs> this is for you as well, wizard. Oh, I threw that way too far. That was an overshot. <laughs> oh, it launches it back at me. That's right. Which is kind of hilarious when I think about it. Hey, it's Ons Box Bow. That does really good damage from what I remember. <laughs> All right, this sludge, huh? That's for you, wizard. Just to finish you off, wizard. Oh, wait. How did the wizard get here so quick? <laughs> That's weird. Whoa. Good dodges, wizard. I guess you're a martial arts wizard, huh? Let's do this to scare him. Woo! Let's keep our defense going. I did not see pot guy. Whoa. Pop your bubble, sir. And while the zombies are there distracting you. We hit you with a giant lightning pot, and we go again with another one. No, oh, what the- oh, oh, the bleed! It has such good range! 
<laughs> that looked like a headshot. Alright, that was kind of chaotic. I almost couldn't see what was going on from all the, like, blood splatter. <laughs> but we win it. <laughs> Rivermouth Cave is definitely that small one with all the enemies, right? I think. Well, you guys have aggroed that. <laughs> There's a dragon, though. Hang on. This will be fun. Hey, Dragon Breath friend. How's it going? <laughs> That's not fun. Nice. There goes one. <laughs> I'll take it. You get the baby pot. Papa King Crimson. Wait. Baby pot for you. Hang on. Into red pot. Into mega pot. Oh, he dodged the giant pot. Unfortunate. Not that one, though. Wait. Crew me back there. Looks like he could take a little pot. Hang on. I didn't know there was another phantom. Big pot. Oh. Nice. Into mini pot. Perfect. <laughs> All right. Just me and you, Papa. Woo. Yeah, there. 360. Nice. Make him panic. Or get aggressive on me. Yeah, that, that could work too. Make him think he's winning this trade. There you go. Woo. Into the red. For the punish on the heel. No, you didn't. All right, Papa. Come back, man. I'm just throwing pots at you. You don't have to fear me that bad. Really? <laughs> it fogwalled me on a pot only build. That's wild. Well, hello there, dragon. It's been some time. How have you been? Looks like you're being harassed. Don't worry. I'll be there to help in one second. Who do I stop? The guy in the back just chucking the lightning? I feel like that's probably a good call. <laughs> I like how he just auto-aimed it for me, but then he took that to the face. Well, this is for you, Phantom. Whoa. You guys took him out. Dishonest. Hi there. I can throw lightning too. Mine's a pot, though. <laughs> Oop. He's falling back for the heal. I need you guys to get a little aggressive on me here. I like a shield. I'm dodging by. Lightning pot. Whoa. Wow, I did 500 damage on the baby pot. Pretty solid. <laughs> I like it. I guess, let me just heal up here. I need to take them in a smaller area, to be honest. In the open, the pots are a little easier to dodge. So. Wait, what the heck? Who just died? Someone just died. I just seen my lucid dream die. <laughs> Lightning! Lightning pot. Oop. Baby lightning pot. <laughs> I'll take that trade. I think I actually did more damage. Giant lightning pot. A thousand damage! That's wild! <laughs> no way, dude. Ooh, we get the Halig tree. There's potential for a gravity kill. Hi there, guys. Giant pot. Oh. No way, dude! <laughs> now I have the high ground for the large pots. Hi, guys. Oh, I don't want to waste those, though. I only have so many, right? You know, you gotta... You gotta be smart with it. Are you guys dove all the way down? This is a terrible spot to be. He might be dead. He was dead. <laughs> Wait, oh. I did not see that other teammate. What is the my camera doing right now? We're good. I'm gonna hide behind this tree. Thank you, tree, for being my defense. This is for the host. <laughs> Hey there. Pot. Red lightning pot on the naked guy. Into this. Into this. <laughs> there goes the host. <laughs> well, you guys chose a really bad battleground, I have to say. <laughs> oh, the tree wasn't done yet. That's a flower, Chase. That's a flower. Oh, Bonnie Jail. Well, there's a little bit of water here. This could be pretty good for me, honestly. Get some defense going. Buff up. Buff up even more. I got my little enemies buffed with me. 
Hi there. Yeah, I definitely don't see you. Oh, 562 on this little pot. Pretty crazy, honestly. Um, he wants to get around me. You know, we're going to do this into this. Oh, that worked rather well. <laughs> Endure into giant pot. Definitely going to be the star of this build. Liernia of the Lakes. This could honestly be very optimal for my lightning pot. Hi there, random phantom. I missed. I don't think he's seen me, though, to be honest. The answer is he definitely did not. Oh. <laughs> the lightning throws are great. Oh. Hey, host. I didn't see you there. This is at our feet. Wow, I out-traded a katana with this. This goes lightning on water. Oh, these are so effective here. Why are you still attacking me? You're crazy. You have two HP. And these keep chipping you. <laughs> oh no. I got a co-invader, but you're too late, wizard. You're too late. Look, wizard, your weakness. A tree stump. <laughs> he just walks away. What is going on here? Little Rich. Hey, man. <laughs> I came in at a pretty rough moment for him, I believe. What the heck? Why were you not helping him? What? What? <laughs> what kind of teammate? Alright, that wraps up all the battles that I have for you guys for today using the pot-focused build. I hope everybody enjoyed the invasions. Once again, there's my stats on the right. The armor that I wore. The talismans that I used throughout the invasions. And I didn't really use this weapon, but I did use it for endure. So, just there so I can trade with the pots. Like I mentioned, there's a huge variety of pots, so you can really run this a few different ways. I just think Dex was my favorite. I like using the Red Lightning pot for the big AoE. Just guaranteed damage on that if they don't know how to roll properly. As always, if you guys have any recommendations on weapons or just things you'd like to see showcased on the channel, feel free to comment it below. I do appreciate all the input that you guys give. Until the next video, this is goodbye. I will see you all next time. Thanks so much for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye.